Hello everyone, I'm Gogi from Gogi.in and you're watching the review of Swipe Ultimate 2-in-1 Tablet. This tablet is currently available on snapdeal.com for Rs 16,250. It is running Windows 8.1, comes with magnetic keyboard inside and uh, Office 365, free for one year. This tablet is powered by Intel quad-core processor, it comes with 2GB RAM, there are dual cameras. There is built-in SIM slot with 3G support. It's powered by 7000 mAh battery. Inside the box, you'll find this tablet, the Swipe Ultimate with a 10.1 inch screen. As already mentioned, this tablet is powered by Intel quad core processor. Inside the box, you'll also find this complementary magnetic keyboard. This will not only provide added protection to the tablet, but also convert it into a full fledged netbook. This is a sleek keyboard, and here is where you will attach the tablet. And this is the stand. Inside the box, you'll also find a warranty card. OTG cable and power adapter to charge up this tablet. Here is the Swipe Ultimate tablet with a 10.1 inch screen sporting a 1280 by 800 pixels resolution. This is with 10 point multi-touch support. It's a big tablet, pretty slim but a bit heavy. The rear side is black color with matte finish and it has got these textures, circular textures that give a very good grip. It feels like rubber. 3.5mm audio jack and the normal USB 2.0 port is placed on the left side along with the speaker out vent. This tablet comes with dual speakers placed on either side on the left as well as on the right. On the bottom side you will find this connector to connect the magnetic keyboard and this is for added support. The buttons are placed on the top side You'll find the power button and volume rocker. And there are a lot of stuffs on the right side. You'll find the micro USB port, mini HDMI port, DC in, microphone, micro SIM and micro SD card slots. Here are the slots. You need a micro SIM and a micro SD card. And this is the speaker vent. Intel logo on the back side, swipe logo and 5 megapixel autofocus camera on the rear without LED flash. On the front you'll find a single touch sensitive navigation button. Front camera of 2 megapixel resolution with LED indicator. Weight is 644 grams and with the flip cover it is 984 grams. The tab is 10.28 mm thick. I'm going to insert the micro sim card and let's power on. This tablet is running Windows 8.1. The experience is just like using a desktop on a tablet running Windows 8.1. Color reproduction is good, touch is very smooth and responsive. The touch sensitive dedicated navigation button has got that Windows logo. There is only one navigation button on the front. This is an IPS screen with 1280 by 800 pixels resolution. Viewing angles are pretty good. There is built-in SIM slot but you cannot use this tablet for making and receiving calls. The SIM slot supports 3G, you can use it to surf the net. I am now going to access the net using my SIM card. It is now connected and let's open up some website. I am now using 3G using my SIM card and surfing the net. I am going to launch my website. You can use on-screen keyboard and here is my website. The battery is at 74% and the time is 10.22. You can set up the brightness, there is no automatic brightness option, you will have to do it manually. The performance is very smooth. Let's check out the system information. This tablet is powered by Intel Atom CPU Z3735F clocked at 1.3 GHz with 2 GB RAM. The screen supports 10 point multi-touch with 1280 by 800 pixels resolution. Of the 32GB, you will get around 24GB space. There is built-in Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and GPS. I have connected an external USB pen drive and it does work. If you want, you can also use the micro USB port for connecting micro USB supported devices. This hardware is powerful. I am now going to play a 4K video to 160 pixels and here is the video. This video file is on the pen drive that is connected with this tablet. I am going to play this file using the Windows Media Player. And as you can see, it works. This tablet can play 4K videos. You can install a lot of stuffs on this tablet, but do note there's a limited storage space of 32GB. 
you can also execute exe files. You do get access to Microsoft Store to download additional applications. You can use the camera application to shoot images. This is with an autofocus camera, 5 megapixel on the rear, 2 megapixel on the front. The rear camera can shoot 1080p videos. Go to the settings and you can access the camera options. As you can see, it can shoot 1080p videos. To switch to front or the rear camera, just use this option here. The camera quality is not that good, it's below average. You can check the sample images on my website. Office 365 comes pre-installed but you'll need to activate it. Here is the magnetic keyboard that will convert your tablet into a netbook. I'm now going to attach the tablet. Once you connect the tablet, you will still need to hold the tablet because there is no support on the back side. This is what I mean. You will need to fold the flip cover this way to create a support for the tablet. So this is done and now you have a netbook running Windows 8.1 with full keyboard access. Here is the QRT keyboard with the touchpad and left and right buttons. I have converted this tablet into a netbook. I can use both the touch and the keyboard for input. Swipe Ultimate is a very good option for checking emails, surfing the web, using Microsoft Word, Excel, PowerPoint and many other applications. This tablet is quite powerful. You can use the on-screen keyboard when using it in the tablet mode. With the keyboard attached, you can use combinations like Alt F4 to close the application and even use Ctrl Alt Delete. You can use the touchpad with the right click and left click button options. The keyboard also comes with three LED notification. For example, the caps lock. When on, you will get the green LED. For a more comfortable experience, you can also connect the mouse. I have connected the mouse and uh, as you can see, it's working pretty well. The best thing I like about this tablet is that it gives you the same desktop experience. As of now, it is connected with the keyboard. It looks like a laptop. I can remove the keyboard and use this tablet and still get the same desktop experience. This is pretty cool. The keyboard is completely packed. If you want, you can attach the tablet and uh, close the flip cover. This will not only provide added protection to the tablet, but it is also a very good option when you're moving around. The keyboard gets power from the tablet itself. This tablet comes with a 7000 mAh battery. You can expect about 6 to 9 hours of continuous usage. This tablet is using Intel HD graphics card. The hardware is pretty powerful for playing low-end games, watching movies, viewing photos and using it for office work. You can change the orientation as per your need. The Swipe Ultimate 2-in-1 3G tablet was initially launched for a price tag of Rs 19,990 but as of now it is available on snapdeal.com for Rs 16,250. Under direct sunlight the screen is barely visible. The Swipe Ultimate is running Windows 8.1 over a 10.1 inch screen. There is 2GB RAM and 32GB of limited storage space. You can connect external pen drive or hard drive using the USB port. This tablet is powered by Intel quad-core processor. Performance is pretty good, lag-free. And this tablet also comes with a built-in SIM slot. Once you insert the SIM card, you can use the 3G networks. However, phone functionality is disabled. You can install applications on this tablet just like you would do on your desktop and laptops. This is a 2-in-1 tablet, use it like a tablet or connect the keyboard and use it like a netbook. The camera quality is below average. If you want to check sample images, you can visit my website for that. Swipe Ultimate 3G 2-in-1 tablet with Intel quad-core processor is available exclusively on snapdeal.com for Rs 16,250. If you like this video, do hit the like button and don't forget to share.